brings you here then? To see if I could find someone I like. A bit of excitement, really. You? Well, my boy, he applied for it. I've got one boy, he's 26. 26? Yeah, yeah. He stops at one. But I was just busy, he didn't have, yeah. didn't have much time. So how, how many children you've got? <coughs> I, um, you want a straight slow, straight slow come horse through or you want <laughs> How many children did you say you've got? Uh, ten. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. That's amazing. But well, you know, amazing not in the positive sense of the word. Mm. So, he probably knew it was game over from then. And then, like you said, I would have just been like, well, we better split this bill because what is the point? What's your youngest at home? Five. Wow. Oh, yeah. Where's their mum then? It's been done four years. Oh, really? Yeah, she was playing the field for about a year before I knew it. It was all coming you out. Didn't know. I didn't know. It can't get past the fact that a woman with 10 kids still find the time to fool around. Yeesh. <laughs> Yeah, well, I think they, they didn't find the mind exciting anymore. No, or the fact that there's 10 kids running around yeah. everywhere. Uh, yeah, it's a bit of a shocker for me anyway. So his youngest is five and his ex left four years ago and she was playing the field about a year before. Sure, the kid, 10 kids is his or his. You see, the, 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 the fact still remains. <clears throat> a guy like that with 10 kids, mm -hmm. I'm sure she must have messed up somewhere along the line probably you know because she has not been able the, the children are not from one mother they are from different mothers at least three four do mothers. you think so well at least at least uh, let's say two three you never said that you they know didn't. no i am just guessing but this is a guy who has come out openly and i mean told the whole world i've got two ten children yes yet i'm still looking for love maybe it's the woman who messed up because this is what somebody is saying the mass is not adding up when the per this person is saying she was playing the field that was something he kind of said quickly but she cheated on him that's why she's gone she's gone and dumped all these 10 kids she's gone she's her she's found somebody so you can it can either be that he messed up or she messed up either way mm -hmm. Something might have gone wrong there, and yeah, this person says, Sure, the 10 kids yeah, are his. I've got six that live at home with me. Really? Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. nice. My problem is who fixed the two together? <laughs> because this man has 10 children. Yeah, and, and she has one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You have to be able to. I mean, fix their thing well. Yeah, I think least. some of these things are just for our entertainment. Yeah, because the whole so. thing makes no sense. Well, our house works. We try and get the stuff ready the night before. Get up in the mornings, make sure they've all got their breakfast, do their teeth, you know, like have a wash or whatever. A bit of a struggle to sort of chase them around a little bit. Did you not think of that when you were having them all? You see, this man, I mean, uh, feeding his children on about 150 pounds a week 200 200 pounds a week mm -hmm. that is not a, a lot of money no. that is just about average yeah that's about average shopping mm -hmm. uh, uh, money yeah for a week in the uk mm -hmm. you know uh so he knew uh, what his income was mm -hmm. before he was making these children mm -hmm. and that is why i have said because you really need to assess yourself and look at your budget before you start making children mm -hmm. You know, if I have five children and I'm going in for the next one, mm -hmm. I have to know whether I mean, I, I mean I'm able to take care of the ones that I have before mm -hmm. I go in. So that's why I'm saying yeah. he, he must have messed up somewhere in his life, mm -hmm. you know. Uh, but uh, I still I still think uh, he can make it up. Now that he has sat down, his children are seeing that, oh, uh, our father needs someone. He cannot just be alone. I'm not, I don't think he's that old. Mm -hmm. you know so he can he can he can have a wife but i hope this may be this may sound very funny i hope if he finds any love he's not going to make any more children <laughs> no. no no you no. know it, it may sound funny but i i, I hope he's not going that way mm -hmm. it is somebody to share your old age with you know mm -hmm. talking sharing ideas and things like mm -hmm. that because the problem that he has on his hand six at home he's not been able to solve it I don't know whether it is to him is a problem, but it should be a problem. It should be a problem feeding six children in the United Kingdom. Mm -hmm. It shouldn't be an easy thing at all. No. So if he should find love, he should make sure that it is love that is found 
and he's not going to make any more children. Yeah. Because a man like that with a youngest being four, how five. Man? five, yeah. And that young one is also home. Yeah. Uh, that is that is no. that is that is incredible. <laughs> it really is. So the woman just gave birth, and uh, after some few years, oh, uh, yeah, just bounced. She went away. Bounced. She bounced four years ago, apparently. So, so that the kid was one. one. Shopping, just food wise, at least two hundred a week. I normally buy fourteen to sixteen liters of milk. Then their clothes is very expensive. They obviously you know, like all the school uniforms, then you've got your school dinners, transport for them. I drive like um, a transporter, so there's plenty of seats in it, it's like a nine seater. Mm -hmm. There you go. Thank you so much. What's that little thing? Hey love, you alright? Yeah, he's, he's really sweet, he's really nice, he's got 10 kids. Everybody's commenting how bad the woman is, but nobody's commenting how amazing their dad is. And then somebody amazing in what way? Well, again, you taking care of the kids. Oh, the ten kids. That's good. That's before yeah. you know the ten kids are taking care of them themselves. <laughs> Except maybe yeah, the because if the youngest is maybe the, the other ones are twenty mm -hmm. plus, mm -hmm. so they they are doing some part time job, maybe mm -hmm. studying and they're helping. Mm -hmm. You know, in the up, uh, upkeep of the house. You know, uh, yeah, I, 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 they don't live at home anymore. No, they are gone. They are gone. But then, like what so, you are saying, somebody said, "How is this guy a hero?" We need to stop glorifying men who are doing what women do every day for their children. <laughs> okay, somebody said, if it was a woman with ten kids, the comments would be different. And yeah, we've, we've discussed this. If the roles were reversed and the guy sat there like that, it would be game over. Everybody would be all over the place. Mm. They would definitely not stand for any of it. His face was a picture when the bill arrived. I would have sensed and offered to give half to him. He sees the bill, he's like, uh-uh. I'm not dealing with that. This is a bill. I don't know I don't know I have a butcher's at or not. Oh, it might be. In any case, uh, you can tell that as soon as she realized the bill was coming, she tried to distract him. Pathetic. But I also don't really know why the guy didn't say anything. Because if you're really struggling and you know, you know, you have all these bills to pay and stuff, I would just ask, just be bold and ask. This is not about chivalry because you don't know the woman from anywhere. It's literally a blind date. The woman is trying to deflect so hard from the bill. Mm. He's thinking, hmm, my children's school fees or what is bill? Things like drag race, is this for you? Sally. It's really good. Mm. Oh, no, guys. You are, mate. I'm going to square it up. Shut me, no problem. Oh, as soon as he said he had 10 kids, that was it. The night was over. And you could tell. You could tell from her her demeanor. She was like, hmm. And yeah, she got a nice free meal in a very interesting luxe place in London, apparently. I mean, my kids are all up. My son's off my hands now. Yeah, I've got a couple of years to go on that one, yeah. Imagine telling someone you have money problems and 10 children and they still don't offer to split the bill. Horrible woman. I, I, I mean, that is just to say that. Now, even if if you know the relationship is not going to go anywhere, knowing that this man has got so much on his plate, mm -hmm. just contribute a little bit. Even look, we are saying share the bill, but mm -hmm. even if if she had paid one third, I would have understood it. Mm -hmm. She was in, not in any way looking for her purse mm -mm, to no. provide anything. She didn't even do the fake. Oh let me oh let me grab and then the guy's like oh no no it's alright I've got it. Oh uh, thank you. She didn't do none of that. She was determined. Yeah. Somebody said this is a blind date. Neither of them asked the other out. So they should absolutely split the bill. On the other hand, if you ask someone out, you should expect to pay the bill. That's also fair. They don't know each other. Mm. Why am I gonna pay a stranger? <laughs> <laughs> a capable stranger's bill, a person's bill, and let them just eat. 
think yeah, man, man. today's world where women want equal rights and all this type of thing, they've been asked if they would offer to pay their way maybe now and again. Even if they didn't do halves, the woman could have uh, said, I'll pay my part, what I ate, what I drank. Mm -hmm. Should we go halves or maybe something along them sort of lines, like, you know? Somebody said, I'm so confused as to why they have to pay for their own food when they're literally providing the content this show is profiting of. Mm. But no, it's a very important point of the date. It's obviously a blind date. Mm. So just talking, 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 obviously that would always lead to a second date. But it's how they handle the bill that usually is the deciding factor mm. of whether that second date even comes, which is off camera. That one we're not there for. Mm -hmm. um, may I add, people have gotten married through this show. Yeah, it happened about two times, three times, something like that. It does happen sometimes. But yeah, they go off to have their own dates or sometimes they don't. Mm -hmm. By the end, they have to say, would you meet this person again? Stuff like that. I don't actually know what these people said. But yeah, um, they, they have to keep that part in because it makes the show that much more interesting. Thanks very much. Thank you. When it's money that I could spend on my kids, like, if, you, if you understand me. But he said, always offer to split the bill and that's final. I support that one. Yeah, always yeah. offer, just offer. Yeah. I think that's that's yeah. fair. You know, if the well, guy, the well, guy should have tried that and mm -hmm. see the comments of the lady, that oh, uh, mom, uh, so uh, the bill is one fifty. Mm -hmm. Can we split it or can you give me fifty? I mm -hmm. I will take the hundred. Mm -hmm. But you know, uh, it, it's it's about support. Reluctantly, mm -hmm. reluctantly paying the bill. He's mm -hmm. going home to cry. <laughs> yeah, because it's not money that he has earned easily. No, I don't know what he does for work, but it's not money that the man, the guy, has earned easily. So just coughing that money out, you know, paying for the bill for a lady you may not ever, ever in your life come My across. Goodness. I think that is painful. She no. was deflecting. She was like, "Oh, it's nice for you to get chance to get out of the house." Mm. And he's like, mm -hmm. and he still has six living at home. Mm -hmm. It would be okay if they were all outside the house, mm -hmm. but you know, you, you know, you wish, you wish every relationship all the best. I think the differences are just. Too much. I mean, the fact that she let him pay. A lot of people were not happy with that. Mm -hmm. A lot of people were like, "That's so greedy." The guy just told you he has he ten, children. ten children. Allowing the man to pay the bill will push the man even off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure this didn't lead yeah, to anything. Yeah, because he, he saw the way they departed. Yeah. The guy was not happy. Nope. The way, you know, the lady went about the whole thing. This is the, just the beginning. Yeah. You know, so uh, uh, a relationship that, like that, if she'd go on, yeah, she's going to allow me to be doing everything. Mm -hmm. A lot could be said about a woman's behavior. It, is, it was disgusting. It was unacceptable. Very, very selfish. You know, I felt so sorry for the man, you know, looking at the bill and knowing that he doesn't actually have much. Mm -hmm. that, ma that money is enough to feed his family for a complete week. And that woman sat down there and, I mean, she didn't show any remorse whatsoever. She mm -hmm. sat there expecting a man like that to food the bill. I mean, she looked like she just came there to get a free meal out of the yeah, whole thing. Yeah, yeah. Because for me, it's like not about having a free meal. Obviously, when you go on a date and you're a woman, you want somebody to pay for the first, a guy to pay for the first meal. But depending on circumstances, surely mm -hmm. you, you, you live your life according to the circumstances, right? Mm -hmm. These circumstances were different. And the fact that, yeah, exactly like this person was saying, she had the gall to actually make some snide remarks mm -hmm. about his kids having to eat beans on toast mm -hmm. now that he's paid for the bill. It really shows that he was, she was just there to have a free meal. The, the, if it is true that it is one of his children who, who set uh, this date, this blind date, mm -hmm. I'm sure they should continue to, to help the father. He, he cannot, he's a very nice guy. He cannot mm -hmm. live alone. Mm -hmm. And I'm sure he, along the line, he will find a lady who understand her, I mean, his situation, mm -hmm. you know. A woman Especially who, once the kids all start going out of the house. Okay, the mm -hmm. five-year-old is going to be interesting, but yeah. Is that if he should find love, he should, he should look for a true love, someone who would understand his background, where he's coming from, and where he's going and someone who will love his children mm -hmm. not only the six but all of ten of them <laughs> if he's ready and prepared to move on with a new love mm -hmm. well 
who are we to say no? Yeah, it could be a, a woman who cannot have children, who is like, great. Yeah. Then, we, I mean, mm, the woman you know. will take all these ones to be her. Change and change for good. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, it, you know, as women, we want to be wine and dined. But if the situation is, is some way, and especially on a blind date, I don't really agree with that. In any case, if you're not already part of the family, make sure you hit bumps, thumb, as don't turn that subscribe button, comment because I really want to know what you think. Like, because you obviously like this video, and hit the notification bell while you had it. I'll see you in the next video, which will be tomorrow. Daily videos up in here. In the meantime, make time for glorious life. It's time to start what? Leave me a try. God bless.